Freyoras, are we ready? Whoa! Yep, you definitely got this stuff sorted out pretty sharpish. Oh my goodness, you still tinkering over there, buddy? Wow! I think we're ready, or almost ready at least, to conduct one of the biggest experiments to date. Our last one was a success, so I've got high hopes for this one. Treyarch, trust, calm down, buddy. You don't have to work all the time. Are we almost ready? Yeah. Good. Well, I better let the guys at home know what we're doing, guys. We, today, are going to try and contact another world. Not just another world. But aliens. We're going to try and bring aliens to the Minecraft world today, right now. It should be epic, so without further ado, I guess we should just get straight to it. So we've got this armor stand right here, which is ready and prepped to go in a special suit. And we're going to be harnessing the power of the Wither Skeleton Skull to try and break through the atmosphere and contact these aliens. And then we're going to use cows, special subject cows, which have been a little bit modified to be able to contact the aliens. This is going to be one of the greatest experiments ever, if we get it right. If we get it right. So, let's grab this Wither Skeleton Skull. Let's pop it on this brain right here. There we go. Look. Looking amazing. <laughs> you look incredible, Mr. Wither Skeleton. You look incredible. Ready for one of the greatest Greatest experiments ever. Treyarch, is everything set up? Where are you, buddy? You're getting a little bit excited, aren't you? <laughs> right then, so is everything ready to go? Is the lever ready to be pulled? Yeah. Cool. Let's do this. Oh my goodness. Three, two, one. There we go. Yes. That sound is good. That sound is very, very good indeed. We just need to wait for a flash. Yeah, there we go. Flash of light. And I think we're ready to go. That was the signal being sent to space. Now... Now we need to test this theory, basically. So let's go in here. Let's grab these three test subjects right here, which just so happen to be cows. And just as a precautionary measure, we need to grab some diamond chest plates, a full diamond armor, a bow, some arrows, and some protection. This is just in case they aren't even friendly, because we have no idea. We've got a few ideas of what they might be carrying. But apart from that, we don't know if they're going to be friendly or not. And then I'm going to grab some of this as well. So let's grab this 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 and this okay i think we're ready for this let's go and try and contact the alien race grim be careful buddy because if things get aggressive out there i'm gonna need you right here we go i'm a little bit nervous actually guys we haven't tested this obviously ever this has never been done before so here we go let's do this so we need to spawn in this test subject right here how you doing buddy i'm sorry i'm going to be trying to contact aliens with you so to be able to activate the the modification chip that's inside these guys i need to throw a redstone torch at them oh he's changed to sacrifice oh oh i did not expect this to work oh my goodness look that is that aliens is he being beamed up by aliens whoa <laughs> oh jeez. He's being taken. Mr. Cow, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean it. Well, I, I kind of did, but he's gone. I think he's going into the sky. That means aliens may have got our message. There he goes. Oh, man. Right, we need to do this again. We need to do this three mm. times to be able to get the message through to them. Yeah, look, there we go. It changes to sacrifice. And then he's off. Oh, ho, ho. aliens, if you can hear me. Please be nice, and please be nice to our cows. Please don't eat them. Keep them as pets. Keep them as a gift from the Minecraft world to yours. Oh, I cannot believe this. Let's try moving it a little bit, see if they can actually move in whatever spaceship they're in. So let's put down another one of these guys, and here we go. Yeah, it's changed to sacrifice again. Oh, geez, look. There we go. He's been picked up again. The other one has gone. It does move as well. Oh, man, my mind is blowing. Trust, this might have worked. Right, I'm going to prepare myself. I forgot to put these on just in case they're nasty creatures. Okay. Aliens, I'm ready to meet you. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Can you hear me through our specially modified cows? If you can, please come down to Earth. We'd love to meet you. We want to do experiments together. It will be... It'll be epic. Is anything happening? Hello? Did they not hear my message? Oh! 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 There it is! Look! There's a UFO! Oh, jeez, what's it going to do? Oh, my goodness, no, no. Ah, ah, that burns. That burns so bad. What is this? Ow, he just hit me with his laser. No, stay away from me. He dropped two aliens. I come in peace, little alien. I come in peace. Oh, my goodness, your name is Bob. Your name is Bob. What's your name? 
Bob and Bill, it's nice to meet you guys. Are you okay? How are you feeling? Ow! No, they're, they're definitely not nice. It's a good job we packed this armor ready to go. I'm going to have to take them down, I think. I'm going to have to do it and see what they're holding. It looks like they're carrying laser guns. All right, here we go. Bill, you're coming with me, buddy. You're coming with me. If you won't come peacefully, then... Oh, jeez, I am in trouble. I'm in big, big trouble. I need to regen a little bit. These guys might be able to take me out. Oh, no, this is dangerous. This is really dangerous. Don't hit me with your guns, you little punk. All right, let's try and take him. There we go. Bill, I'm going to take you down, buddy. I'm going to take you down. Come on, a couple more shots, maybe. They can't be too powerful. There we go. I took him down. I got him. I got him. Now you. Bob, you're going down. Bob, you're going down. Oh, he almost took me down. Oh, jeez. No, I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm going to pick up this stuff and run and eat at the same time. Oh, jeez. Where did he go? There he is. The little sneaky punk. Right. It's time for a face-off. Me and you right now. Here... We go. Let's do this. Ah, go on, Bob. I'm going to take you down, buddy. I'm going to take you down. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Yes. Yes, I got his shield downs. Oh. Oh. I just beat up an alien. I just beat up two aliens. Oh, my goodness. This is crazy. What did they drop? That was so close. They almost took me out. Um, we've got prismarine crystals. Okay. Prismarine shards. Does that mean they're to do with guardians, maybe? Who knows? Oh, DNA analyzer. This is exactly what Treyos talked about. And... Alien gravity boots, alien suits. Wow, this is cool. Actually, their UFO is still here. Uh, excuse me, Mr. UFO. Is there anyone still inside there? It's a good job I have a bow with me. Right, let's try and take this guy down as well. See if he's got anything inside him. Oh, jeez. Are these arrows even working? I don't even know. Right, let's keep on Let's keep on firing. Let's keep on firing. Yes, it worked. Awesome. What is dropped here? We're still looking for one more particular item that Treyarch talked about, and this might be it. Yes, the crystal power source. A source of power unlike any you've ever seen. Wow. Wow, right. I'm going to switch this out. I'm going to put on the alien armor. Here we go. Let's put this on. We've got resistance to... Whoa, regeneration to forever. Oh, my goodness. And alien gravity boots. Jump boost. And I got their... I've got their thing as well. Look, I've got their... Um, I've got their shield. How cool is that? Oh, man. We actually just defeated a couple of aliens and stole their stuff. This is amazing. Right. We need to go back inside and see Treros. And we should be able to jump over this because, you know, jump boost. <laughs> A simple jump boost. And Treros, look. Look, I've got my own alien suit. How incredible is this? Uh -huh. Yes, it worked. Right. Let me take this off a second because otherwise it's going to get in the way. Oh, my goodness. I got two things as well. I got this, which is the DNA analyzer. And I got a crystal power source, too. So are we ready for part two of the experiment? Uh -huh. Awesome. Right. So me and Treros discussed this earlier. Because if it worked, we'd be able to do this. And I really can't believe it worked already. Right, let's grab a dispenser. And then we need to place it upwards like this. And then plop in the crystal power source. And then something should happen. Trust, I don't think it's happening. Is it working? Hello? Um, Trust, I don't think it's worked. We might have got this one wrong, buddy. We might have got this one wrong. I have no idea what's going on. Okay, let's try this again. Let's stand on top, look right into the center, and place it inside. Oh, geez, look, it worked, yes. Oh, yes, it did work. I didn't do it right the first time. Look, it's working. This must be to do with the Guardians. Maybe, Treros, maybe the Guardians are actually aliens. Who knows? But anyway, this should have turned into, yes, a DNA manipulator. So what we can do with this is combine it with the DNA analyzer and be able to manipulate genetics a little bit. So I'll show you with this pig right here. So let's bring this pig into the world and then kill it with the DNA analyzer. And as you can see, look, a spawn pig egg just landed in my inventory. Now I put this in here. And if we've done this correctly, I should be able to use iron bars all the way around the outside. And yes, it worked. A pig spawner. This is massive. This is a scientific breakthrough. Unlimited food from a DNA extractor, an analyzer, and pig DNA. How cool is that? Right, I want to try it with another one just to check it works. So chicken incoming. Kill it with a DNA analyzer. There we go. We got the, uh, the spawn chicken. Now we surround that with the iron bars yes chicken spawner it works it definitely works oh my goodness now we need to take this one step further and we're gonna use it on humans treros where are you treros i need your permission to use this on humans should be should it be stable 
Okay, uh, I'm gonna try it anyway, so let's grab this villager right here. Let's spawn him in. Hello, how are you doing, sir? I'm afraid this might sting a little bit. There we go, there we go. Right, we got the, we got the spawn villager egg. Now, if we do the same, this could be epic if it works. Here we go, guys. Boom. Yes, it works. Look, villager spawner. Oh my goodness. Look, and it works. Whoa, whoa, Travis. This is incredible. This is the most incredible thing I've ever seen. We've just conducted a scientific breakthrough thanks to the help of aliens. We've managed to get their equipment, and wow, we've managed to clone villagers from a single villager's DNA. Guys, we did it! Oh my goodness, Travis, how are you feeling? Look, he's come to say hello. How are you feeling, buddy? Yeah, we actually did our second successful experiment in a row. Oh, I'm feeling good. Right then, guys, we have got major findings to record, so we are going to leave it there. Thank you so much for joining us in our attempt to talk to aliens. We did it, and we managed to use their technology to clone villagers. How awesome is that? Look at them all looking at me. It's kind of creepy, actually. So thank you so much for watching, guys. If you did enjoy, then please leave a big fat thumbs up. That would be awesome. And also, if you want to try and contact aliens yourself, there is a little video in the description which will tell you how to do so, along with a helpful command that will help you to be able to do it. So definitely check those two out, and I will see you guys in the next video. If you happen to enjoy this video and it happens to be the first video you've seen by me, then please do consider subscribing and joining Team TDM today for daily Minecraft videos and experiments. And of course, we will see you in the next video. Goodbye!